Hey guys, it's Ebony with Tiny Texas Garden, and I'm just excited to get some things in the dirt. So I'm going to go ahead and plant some of the cabbage and broccoli starts that I started. Um, I'm not even sure how well they're going to do, because in the springtime our weather can get really hot really fast, and the really more cool weather plants, but we'll see. Here we go. Okay, so I'm just going to dig some holes and drop these cabbage broccoli down in them. These are just starts, starts that I started from seed indoors. They look pretty good. They're teeny. They look pretty good. So we'll see how they do. We'll put them in the ground. Cabbage and broccoli, it's pretty easy though. It's just one per square foot. I'm hoping that these will do okay because this side of this garden bed is not the side that gets the most sun. So I'm hoping that even if it gets really warm, that these will still do. Okay, how many do I have? I have four, four cabbage. You probably can't see this hole. Four cabbage and four broccoli. Let's get these in here. I don't know if they like to have their roots disturbed or not. So I'm just going to not disturb them and assume that they will find a way to... They're finding their way to the new dirt, the new soil. But yeah, I'm so excited for spring. But not so much for allergies and that sort of thing. cabbage to the broccoli in the front and the cabbage. What have you guys been planting? Have you been able to get out and into the garden yet? I mean, now here in Texas, zone 8A, we've been having pretty good mild weather. And good weather to get out and get the garden beds ready. Look at that clay. Yeah, there's no longer a question that this garden bed is not a true raised garden bed any longer. I'm digging right into into our uh, <gasps> look worms. Can you see him? Uh, can you see him? Oh, there he is. Worms and clay. I think we have made it, guys. Yes. I'm sorry, little worm. Go back down. I'm sorry. You're doing a good job because this soil looks good. You are down there working hard. Working hard. So, yeah, so this is exciting to see. I mean, because we only built. Lots of worms. Hopefully I'm not hurting anybody. Um, we only built this this bed last summer. So it looks like the cardboard that was underneath in the bottom has already broken all the way down. And we've got Nature's little garden helpers. Worms all the way through it. 
That makes me very excited. Ooh, this one's a little tough. There we go. Or I'm weak. I don't know. No, we're gonna go with this a little tough. There we go. You know what's odd is on this end of the bed, I'm getting to the clay much sooner than I am on the other end of the garden bed where we put the tomatoes. I wonder, I guess I just didn't, like we just haven't put as much soil on this end, I guess. Okay, so. other broccoli over here in the corner. Let me see. Uh oh. I messed up my very delicate balance or my camera. I'll show you when I'm done. <laughs> okay guys, so there we go. We've got cabbage, four cabbage along the back, three broccoli, and one fourth broccoli here up front. Hopefully they will be okay here. I'll keep you posted.